Good day YouTube. This is just another quick video to show you the difference between uh, the RAM and CPU usage comparison on Ubuntu Cinnamon uh, Remix Edition, so 19.10, which is the latest release. And on the right we've got the uh, Linux Mint Cinnamon 19.3, also latest release there. So let's just show up a few little terminal bits and pieces of information here so we can see what we've got there. There we go. Now we'll uh, we'll jump open to a new tab window, terminal window for each of these here, and we'll just have a quick look at uh, what we're dealing with when it comes to the RAM. And here we go. So it's a very interesting sort of a situation here. Linux Mint 19.x, whatever it may be, has come a long way in recent years. So if we were to zoom in a little bit, we can see it's only using just above 418 megabits of uh, megabytes of RAM straight off the bat there uh, on boot up, of which both of these are on boot up here. So let's close off anything else that we don't really need. A couple of windows, which means we close them off, and we've even got more RAM. And away we go, close and close. But uh, there we go. So yeah, even more RAM, 407 megabytes of RAM. U uh, Ubuntu, very, very similar here to a lot of Ubuntu distributions or releases. Uh, it's sitting at around the, the one uh, gigabyte mark, which is just way too much, I guess I could say. The RAM is seeming to be idling out on both, which is good. Uh, we've got uh, just a few more threads on the Ubuntu side of things, Ubuntu Cinnamon. But otherwise, as you can expect, they do look somewhat similar, somewhat the same. With a bit of a Ubuntu touch on the left and a bit of a uh, Linux Mint touch on the right. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Just a super simple quick video. If you've, got a, if you've got an old laptop, I would probably very much recommend using the Cinnamon on the right, latest release over Ubuntu on the left. But uh, yeah, like I say, quick little video, uh, bit of a fun one like all of my others here at the moment. And uh, yeah, please leave a comment, subscribe, and uh, thanks for watching.